Madonna, you've just given the award to Rupert Everett for most stylish male, and he's the only English man in the category. Would you say that English men are more stylish than Americans? Absolutely. <laughs> Could you extend? Yes, go on. Mm. I like the um, sort of... Um, it's kind of inexplicable. It's a strange combination of being really conservative and really eccentric. Don't you think? Yeah. Which is Rupert summed up, really, isn't it? Mm. You're a trendsetter, you know. Young people follow your stuff. So is there anything that you think, okay, I'm going to go for this look because it suits my music this year? Mm. I'm into pants that are too long. Okay. Yeah, pants dragging, pants hanging off the crack of your ass. I'm Not a plum. Pleasure. Sorry. Can we like them? No, we like that. No. Pants hanging off the crack of your bum, too long, dragging on the ground. So you fancy British builders then? Exactly. Builders' pants. We drink builders' tea, we wear builders' pants. Oh, you'll fit. You'll have builders in the Winnebago. <laughs> <laughs> Which is good. Okay. And we like a builder. You do? Yeah. Okay. You like men oh. that build. Greasy calf. <laughs> greasy calf, nothing better than. You've been showing her great places in London stuff. Oh, baby, greasy calf. Boys in greasy well, calf. I can get Don't her out of think? bed. She doesn't usually get up like before two o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> okay, so I have enough personal information. <laughs> so you've worn many designers and now you're wearing Stella stuff. How has fashion changed over the years for you wearing it? How do you feel it's changed? I wore Stella's designs before she worked for Chloe, before she, you know, made it big and got all commercial and everything. Yeah, sold out. Before she moved to Paris and sold out, exactly. Now, Stella, you were with VH1. You, you were at the launch party of VH1 five years ago. You've come a long way since then. It's been cool. You know, I haven't been thinking about it that much. I've just been going with it. It's a discount at Cartier. That's good. That is good. Oh, I just plugged Cartier. <laughs> That's fantastic. Um, it's been good, you know. It's been a weird journey, but not just in my career and everything. So I've just been kind of going with the flow, see what happens. I want it all stop, and I want to get off now. That was really dirty. Um, well, I've always had a strange alliance with the fashion industry and uh, throughout my career. And I've made some really great friends along the way, professionally and personally. And I would just like to take this time to thank all of you who've been so great to me, from Jean-Paul Gaultier, to Stephen Mizell, Orlando Pita, to the Versace's, and many more that I can't name because you don't have all night. Thank you very much.